One of the first things I think about when I think about Florida food is fish. A grilled fish sandwich is a quintessential Florida dish. If there's anything more quintessentially Florida than a fish sandwich, it's citrus. So we decided to combine the best of both worlds and make a grilled fish sandwich and a citrus salad. This week on Working Class Foodies. Unfortunately, even a local fish is not always an eco-friendly fish. Where we're from on the Gulf Coast, you're more likely to see grouper, but that wasn't the eco-friendly fish we were looking for. But with just a little bit of research on the Monterey Bay Aquarium Seafood Watch website, we found out that Mai Mahi is not only local to the Gulf Coast, but also sustainable and eco-friendly. And delicious. So we substituted with Mahi Mahi, which is just as popular. We stopped by Overholt's produce stand. Outside of the Saturday's Only Farmer's Market, Overholt Stand is the best place in Sarasota to get local fruits and vegetables. The citrus at Overholt is as juicy as it looks, and the prices are amazing. The basket is ripping. The whole basket? All right, well, let's just do the whole basket. Yeah. I'll buy salad. Especially coming from New York. This pineapple is 50 cents. In New York, that would be a $6 pineapple. Sunshine to survive. There's cheese on top of bagel. There's fresh melon by its side. With a huge mahi-mahi steak and enough grapefruit and tangelos to last us a week, we headed home to fire up the grill and get lunch going. So we decided to pair our mahi-mahi with a citrus salad made of segmented ruby red grapefruit. Attach an ID number of items. Pomelo. Be of interest to it. Okay, let's keep going. Laptops, TV sets, and stereos, and cameras, and anything. Mm. That's more really good, though. The campus police can And to give the salad a little kick of heat and some extra color, we added jalapenos. Of six cases. Cilantro. And radishes. And I made a dressing using the tangelo juice. From students, rooms, suites, or apartments. Pepper. Salt. When the doors were unlocked. Other thefts. The salad came together in a really interesting and exotic way. It was tart from the citrus, there was some heat from the radish and the jalapeno, and a little bit of sweetness from the tangelo juice. It was a really great balance to the meaty richness of the fish sandwich. Mahi Mahi is a really great fish for cooking because it's very forgiving. It's not really like tuna or salmon, it's got a very clean, smooth taste. I'd say it's most akin to swordfish if you've ever had that. But it doesn't have any of the fishy smell when you're making it. Yes. It's also really great on the grill.
what I really like about Mai Mai is that it has a lot of flavor of its own, but it also is very malleable. You know, it goes very well with citrus or with just a little olive oil and salt, and it holds up well to heat, too. A lot of fish doesn't do that. So for our Mahi Mahi sandwiches and our citrus salad, we spent $12, which comes down to $6 a person. I dare you guys to go find a fish sandwich and salad combo for less than $6 a person. All gone. So, now it's your turn. Write in, let us know what your favorite local hometown meal is. And how you make it at home. Mm -hmm. And we'll see you next time on Working Class Foodies. No, this is London residents, the Novik Hotline.